how to transfer music from Windows computer to your iPhone using iTunes. So the first thing that we need to do is to connect your iPhone to iTunes. So using the USB cable here, connect to your phone. It will ask you to grant a trust permission. Tap on the trust button on the phone. I have previously already grant the trust, so it will not show up this time. Okay, so once you plug in your phone into the computer, on your computer, you can just open up iTunes. If you do not have iTunes, you can download it from Apple. So just type in iTunes on Google search and download iTunes to your computer. iTunes is a software from Apple. Okay, once iTunes has opened, it will try to attempt sync to your iPhone if you have previously set up your iPhone with iTunes. If this is the first time that you set up your device, it will ask you to uh, sync the device. Okay, there are two ways how you can transfer music from your Windows computer to your iPhone. The first method is to allow uh, iTunes to manage your music. So whatever you place music in iTunes, it will be able to sync to your iPhone. And the other way is to manually manage your music. So when you plug in your device, you can see there are two sections here. It can look uh, confused because uh, at the top here in library, it shows songs. And at the bottom, it shows music. So songs are basically uh, all the music that's stored on your Windows computer. It is not yet gone to your music library yet. And down here in the device section, this is where all your music store on your iPhone. So this is basically your uh, iPhone storage showing music uh, files. Okay, so the first method is to use the sync method. So if you want to import music from your computer to, so I'm just gonna place it here. Okay, so if you want to import your music, to your phone, what you do is you select the files. So go to the folder where it has all your music MP3 files or music files, and you select them. Here you can drag onto your iTunes libraries. So you go to the top and you click on songs. So in library, you click on songs and you drag all your music files and you drop it in here. Now, once it is in here, it is still not on your iPhone yet. You can see here, if I go down to my iPhone, the device, and click on music, it's still not transferred over yet. You need to sync it over to your iPhone. So what you want to do is click on your device icon at the top corner right there. Click on it. And then you go down and you click on sync. Okay, now it will start to sync your music over to your iPhone. So I say preparing to sync at the moment. So give it some time. Okay, so now it's copying files over, and here it is. So if I go to my iPhone, and if I open up my music folder, my music app, you can see now it transferred the uh, music files over. Okay, so that is the first music. And here you can see if I go to the top, and if I uh, go to music, so click on sync. So I'll show here, sync music five songs. I can choose to sync the entire music library, or I can simply just select what I want to sync over, such as playlists, artists, albums, and genres. So you can choose to sync the whole thing or just certain files. Okay, so here I'll select the whole uh, music, entire music library. And then I click on done. Okay, so here if I delete a song, delete from library, click on delete songs, and then I go to sync. And then I go to music, that will eventually remove the songs after it has finished the sync. Now this method can be slow because you have to perform several actions. If you prefer to manually manage your music, then what you do is you click on the device icon here at the top. Okay, so you click on the device icon at the top and then you go down 
on the right hand side here you go down to the options section and click on manually manage music in videos so here click on manually manage music in videos okay so once you have done that click on applied button and then click on sync and then click on done okay so we go back here now go down to the devices section and click on music from here you can manually manage it now so i can click on the delete button directly from my device so this is basically where we are deleting directly from the device so if i go to my library here it should have removed from the iphone so if i click on delete here delete from library and click on delete it should have removed so here it is it's removing the songs there's still one file hasn't been removed yet i think it has an issue uh, previously it has not finished um, the sync i can manually delete in here as well delete from library delete from library okay so we got here if i want to add files to my uh, iphone i can click on this here drag it in and then it should be popping up on my iphone straight away so if you want to manually manage it, uh, manage your music you can do so as well it will be faster as well so here uh, i can add in these songs and that goes to my iPhone straight away. So here, another one, I drag it in, and then it should appear on my iPhone straight away. So that's another way how you can do it, is to manually manage your music. I can delete that, and when I click on delete, it will remove. So here, click on delete, then click on delete here, and it should be removed from my iPhone. Okay, so that is another way. So again, the top part is the songs that store on your computer. The bottom part here in devices section, Add the songs or files that store directly on your iPhone. And that's it. I hope this uh, video helped you out. And you can now understand how to transfer music to your iPhone or how you can manage it. If you find it helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel for more helpful, uh, helpful videos.